Hey guys, I'm Imani here. I'm Emily Swallow and I play the armorer and you are about to watch Ahsoka with Imani and the old man. <laughs> hey Star Wars geeks, Imani and the old man here with you again. So uh, I hope you liked that introduction we just did. Special thanks to Emily Swallow for doing that for us. Like she's never going to watch this. But uh, special thanks to her and you'll probably be seeing that in every episode that we do of Ahsoka here. So, we're about to do, do our reaction to the series premiere of Ahsoka. Oh, that's so exciting. Why didn't you get Ahsoka, Ahsoka to do this? Well, I haven't met Ahsoka yet, Rosario Dawson. Mm. Alright, so, uh, before we get into it, don't forget to subscribe to our channel, turn on your notifications, give us a thumbs up, and if you like, leave us a comment. If you don't know, we are trying to reach 1,000 subscribers in 2023. We're not doing so good. And it's like we... <laughs> Get like a little bit uh, each time we do a reaction video, but uh, we're still not there yet. I think we're somewhere in the neighborhood of 960 last time I checked. Maybe but, we'll uh, pick up some Star Wars fans. Yeah, right? so, you know, guys, help us out. All right, so, uh, series premiere of Ahsoka. Now, as you guys know, if you've been watching our reaction videos, the old man has seen every live action appearance of Ahsoka so far. But uh, he has not seen all of her animated stuff. In fact, probably yeah. hasn't seen most of her animated stuff. When you talk about the history of the character, mm -hmm. no. I have, we've been trying to watch the last season of Star Wars Rebels. I uh, haven't finished it yet. Kind of dropped the ball on that one. Yeah, we kind of drifted away from it. But, uh, you know, we're, we're, you know, hopefully, you know, I get that done by next week. So, uh, you know, he'll be fully informed about Ahsoka and everything before... Uh, the next episode, but he, he knows a lot about Ahsoka, I and mean, I've I've educated him as best I can. You know, former you know Padawan to Anakin left the Order before her training was complete, but is still you know despite having left the Order, she is still one of the most powerful Force users around at this time. So uh, uh, good to know, and you know she uh, has had a lot of history with the Rebels from Star Wars Rebels, which you're probably going to see a lot of in this show. All right, so uh, any questions, old man, before we get started that uh, you feel like you should know before we go, before we go in? No. No? Okay. You done jabbering? I think I'm done. In that case, Imani, push the damn button. Let's go. So this takes place after episode three? Six. Yeah, six. Third movie that actually came out. Mm-hmm. Supposed to know who Morgan Elsbeth is. I that does not ring a bell with me, Morgan Elsbeth. Help us out. Wonder what that reminds me of. Yeah. And well, obviously it's a you know New Republic cruiser. I just remember the Star Destroyer going overhead in the very first movie and how just absolutely in awe I was. Mm -hmm. I'm calling their bluff. Signal them to come aboard. Don't let them come aboard. Mm. These Jedi. Where's Akbar when you need him? Because it's a trap. Mm -hmm. If you know they're bluffing, why would you let them aboard the ship? Because he thinks he can have gun them. I don't know who's on the ship, and I'm betting he can't. Well, if there's anything resembling a Jedi, I wouldn't bet on it. You got six guards. If you don't mind me say, it's quite a surprise beating Jedi out here. Hmm. Our existence remains a mystery to most, Captain Hale. I mean, how many known Jedi are there at this point? I bet it's us, and these imposters for identification. Allow me to show you our identification. Yeah. Play on the uh, Obi Wan line. I believe that's Ray Stevenson. Yep, that's who it is. Mm. It's either going to spring me or kill you. I don't know what. Oh, okay, I remember her now. The first time 
you saw Ahsoka on the Mandalorian. Ahsoka? She was uh, oh. controlling this town that uh, Mando helped her uh, recapture and set the people free. Remember, she was holding the uh, Beskar spear that uh, Mando took with him. Hmm. Okay, got it now. And we're going to assume this is our girl. Well, the uh, shape of her head would uh, definitely suggest that. Also, she just kind of walks like she's somebody. Mm -hmm. I think she's, uh, if, if the first thing was a door, she'd like, the hell with that. Making my own door. It seems a little showy. <laughs> well, I mean, it's like, so many Jedi, they, most of them don't make use of their, you know, force telekinesis and, you know, using their, their lightsabers with it. Like, why don't more Jedi throw their lightsabers? You know, it seems kind of obvious. Well, I mean, it's one of the things you learn in any kind of combat is you don't throw your weapon unless you have to. Mm. Then you don't have it. Well, that's what I'm saying. Then you take, you get it back. Mm. Looks like something out of Fifth Element. Mm. Yep. Or Indiana Jones, I don't know which. Yeah. Yep. Star Wars and Indiana Jones created by the same people. I'm sorry, that would be inclined to run at this point. Because I've seen Indiana Jones. That's right. And when things start clicking and moving, usually it's not good for you. I, I, I ain't gonna be no Dr. Octopus. Okay, that was... A I got the reference, but I don't know that anybody else did. The guy who played Dr. Oct Octopus was in the first Indiana Jones. Oh. He died an ugly death. Hey, Man. I heard the tell him. See, I thought people might, you know, like, what did he mean by that? And, like, start well, thinking about it. They probably did, and I just didn't want to strain him. Hmm. Okay, I feel like that might be from Star Wars Rebels, but I couldn't swear to it. No, it's from Phantasm. Little blades stick out of me. It goes flying around the room, killing people. Oh, well, then that's, you know, again, run away. Yeah. Mm. He got a little fancy weapon. Yeah. Uh oh. Every time we look, ah. there's another one. Yeah. Keep going, keep going. Well, dang, it's gonna be a big boom, isn't it? Yep. Damn! Run! This is one of them predator sized booms. Ain't bigger than that. I mean, Arnold had like what? 20, 30 second head start? He made a big boom. You know who that is? We didn't keep at no. such a safe distance. Maybe we wouldn't have lost communication. No. Listen to his voice for a second. I am Jedi mission to the job of a Jedi Padawan learner, which I am not. No? No. Would you anyway, recognize him better if he were using I'm his sonic screwdriver? For that. Right, where which one? Number 10. Which one? How did you get her to tell David Tennant. I'm Dr. Say I yep. didn't follow standard Jedi protocol. The character, however, is uh, during the uh, Old Republic days, in the uh, prequels, he was tasked with helping new Padawans pick out their lightsabers. The droid. Yeah. And uh, designing it for them. Ah, the home. 
home one. What? The home one. Okay. Admiral Akbar ship. Whether Akbar is here, I don't know. Where did he croak? He died during the sequel trilogy. Hello, old friend. General Sandola. It's good to see you. Why would you make a map of that? That's not possible. People make maps of a lot of weird things in Star Wars. His death was never confirmed, so. Who's that? Thrawn disappeared along with Ezra Bridger. A, uh, so enemies believe that they know uh, his book. Young Padawan. Did I see him in one of the animated shows? Yes. Okay. He was one of the rebels. Let's take a look at this map. We can't. Like, remember all the hoops the they had to jump through in the... Hey, there's that. No, that's that actor. Oh, right there. Remember all the hoops they had to jump through in the sequel trilogy to find out where Luke was hiding? Let's face it, nobody ever found out where Obi-Wan was hiding until he came out. Yep. But did Obi-Wan make a map that they could follow? Probably not. Right. It's like, if you want to go into hiding, why do you make a map? And the Bridger and the thought I, leaders thought I recognized that voice. On our May their courage he's had a career. Never mm -hmm. be forgotten. Can't think of his name right now, but Here he's had a career. Is one of those I don't know where she went. You'd have to say something. What? Come hmm. before me. While we wait for the man to run to us, the words of wisdom. Uh, I got nothing. Better. Yeah. Thank you, Governor Azadi, for that. I mean, I can BS with the best of them, but I don't have a whole, whole lot of minutes to do that. Security, I will then. Find her now. If I find her, you want me to bring her in? Uh, I'm guessing if she doesn't want to come, it might be a problem. Yeah. I mean, I don't want to be the one to try to bring Sabine in. <laughs> well, she ain't just gone. She's gone, gone. Sabine, also one of the rebels, a uh, Mandalorian girl, who uh, I'm pretty sure is force sensitive, but uh, has never been fully trained, and uh, also has a uh, uh, passion for tagging and also. Uh, no, wait, that the. Ezra was the one who liked to collect helmets from Imperial troopers. But yeah, she likes she likes to do art. Well, it's gonna go worse for her than for you. Gonna shoot at her, so yeah. I mean, I'm sure you get outrun her, but yeah, what good's it gonna do? Mm -mm. What's that? That's a loaf cat. What kind of cat? Loaf cat. Hey. You know, you're, you're very much a nerd, right? I just remember what they tell me, some of it, anyways. You know, there are uh, zero. Uh, Earth animals in the Star Wars universe. Nothing I've ever seen. Just uh, general approximations. You can't just have a cat. No. Nope. Gotta be a loaf cat. I've never seen a live action as well. Well, neither has anyone else except in trailers. Seem I was pretty sure Ezra, you know, would have liked to have been romantic with Sabine at different times. So, kind of weird him saying that they're like brother and sister. Could be a trick. Yeah. And who's this guy? Fourth to the party. She has it. Plant we were just on, I guess. And what's she supposed to do with it? Capture her? 
Sure. You know, use her as leverage to get Ahsoka. Still don't know who that other guy is. Guess he's just gonna be the strong, silent type for the moment. You know, a lot of people in Star Wars, they just kind of have a, you know, blanket answer for every situation. You know, you know, Jedi's like, you know, the Force will be with you, or may the Force be with you. With Mandalorians, it's this is the way. Still in one piece? Oh, yes. I'm still 75% original power. All right. Good for you. <laughs> I guess. I mean, is that good for a droid? I'll be foolish. I think I know how to find Ezra. Assuming he's alive. Nope. And Ben, you just got her attention. Can I take this? Where are you going? Somewhere I can think more clearly. Somewhere where an evil Jedi can get to you. Yeah. I'm not sure that's a good idea. It's not. Okay. She's gonna steal it. You know she's gonna steal it. Oh, I think she knows her that well. And didn't most of them disappear because he was dead? Most of them, yeah. A lot of them went into hiding. Most from an apprentice. That would be my assumption. I mean, aren't most Sith and other Force users who are no longer Jedi? I mean, weren't they all Jedi at some point? So, what kind of skill level is Sabine? Well, as a as a general fighter, she's pretty advanced. She was never a great uh, lightsaber wielder. At one point, she had the dark saber, but she wasn't very good at it. I had to be real happy. Don't touch that. You know it's gonna touch it. <laughs> uh, uh. Looking for a key, okay? You you put a ball right in front of me. What did you think was gonna happen? This thing's a cat. <laughs> you can call it whatever kind of cat you want, but it's a cat. <laughs> You. Right. Ahsoka doesn't remember being a young Padawan she, under Anakin. She had changed a little. Yeah. I'm assuming she still doesn't have the, the armor, does she? She had some armor. I don't know if it's uh, Beskar, but she had something. Away from her. Mm -hmm. Isn't that the case of most Jedi's? Luke never finished his training. I would say he did. No, I don't think he ever went back. Just like I walked away from Sabine. I mean, didn't, I mean, don't you think Yoda completed his training? They didn't show it, they didn't show it to us. Some... And a smart Jedi is, you know, never done learning, even after you pass your trials. You know, even, uh, you know, even Yoda, you know, they had episodes where he would learn new things during the Clone Wars. It's a friggin' Rubik's Cube. I, I was about to make a joke, like, the tr you have to get all the colors on one side. Now, you just figured it out. This is usually the part where the bad guys show up. And boom! And that's why you have dogs, cats, or, you know, whatever else. Fighting hand to hand with droids. Uh oh. Do you have a lightsaber? She has a lightsaber. Huh. I mean, you're a Mandalorian and you don't have like a whole arsenal? That's too bad. I think you're punching above your weight class here. Oh my god, your stance is so basic. I'm messing with you. You will be too late. You are so out of class. Yeah. If, 
she were if she were smart, she'd kill you and run. Then her game would be over. She's gonna do the superhero right, landing. Alright, let's just think of that. Are you gonna do the superhero landing? Seen this more. It looked pretty bad, but I guess it's a little to the side, so you know, maybe. All right, so there was episode one, but we're not done yet because we're gonna roll right into episode two. So let's do it. Okay, yep. don't understand how she's not dead, but hey, I'm happy. Girl, you got some work to do. Yep. And more to the point, where are your weapons? We took the mat Alex. I mean, she should have had an arsenal in her house. Wouldn't do any good. They caught her out of her balcony. Mm -hmm. Chilling. But when she was going to confront the the Jedi girl, you know, she Grab your lightsaber. You know, the, like the weapon she was probably least proficient in. This looks like the same place that uh, Mando took Grogu to. So, do we know if Ray finished filming the show? I'm pretty sure he did. It seemed like I saw the first trailer before I heard he had passed away. So, I would hope that meant that he had finished. And, How? How'd you do that? And the map is to find Thrawn. Mm -hmm. Wherever him and uh, Ezra may have ended up, which is apparently in another galaxy. Oh, are those star whales? They disappeared on uh, star whales, I think, if I remember correctly. Yeah, good old star whales. Oh, come on. You've seen star whales and other stuff before. We got a whole clan of these things? You mean a school? A clutch? Oh, you're talking about the loaf cats. Yeah. Oh, Clowder. Cats. It's Clowder. Mm -hmm. Learned that on Big Bang Theory. Or glaring. What are you... Left one behind? Huh. Like the one that she shot was still around? Yes. Okay. This operation somewhere else. I say go for it. Like not the middle. You're on the ground. <laughs> There's no time to relocate. We're falling behind. We'll just take a few minutes to fly out of the city. Tents which are based on. You, you got a Stargate or something? I feel the path forward is clouded. The Eye of Sion is on its way here. Make sure that everything... The Eye of Sauron? Sauron will come through this path. Well, so. Say that he does. Huh. It's so Katano. This is Lynn Weaver. Hmm. Regional supervisor. I was just... There he is. I was just wondering where he was. facilities. <laughs> He's got a neat name or his camera where he is. I forgot the damn droid's name. Munch, Chunk, Chopper. Chopper, there you go. How did you remember that? An empire doesn't just become a republic overnight. Many Padawans over the centuries. And I can safely say your aptitude for the Force would fall short of them all. Well, yeah. Well, then. I've never seen her do anything that indicated she was any more of her time. like really force sensitive. Classified. I'm a general. Nothing's classified to me. I'm sorry. I cannot unseal a document without authorization. I'm authorizing, authorizing, you. authorizing you. From what should you take? On a bet. See, 
Yeah. It doesn't smell right. Why do you ask? It doesn't smell right since I came here. Assassin's orders. <laughs> Well, you know what, buddy? I think uh, everybody on here is pretty dirty. Ah, yeah. no, nah. yeah. yeah. that was a chance. That was kind of a you know superhero landing with a roll, which isn't as cool. Yeah. Is that a? Mm -hmm. That's an Inquisitor. Now, in my experience, an Inquisitor strength lie in their numbers. One Inquisitor against a highly trained Jedi, no chance. What about one teamed up with an HK droid? I mean, she made short work of them back on the other planet. Hey, you need to uh, get the eyes, man. There you go. Now, let's you and I have a proper discussion. Yeah, you go ahead. Whatever makes you feel better. Did you just put your hands on your hips, Chopper? Anakin would have just thrown the ship down. Okay, looks like it's ready to break atmosphere. He didn't just do that. Yeah, he did that. He got him. Yeah, and he did the muscle pose. I'm here. Well, that Inquisitor was uh, better than most I've seen. Mm. There you go. You know, stop, you know, trying to fight like a Jedi, fight like a Mandalorian. Come on, say it. Mm, not sure if that's her creed exactly. Shoot. Yep. Shoot. <laughs> It's not loyalty. It's greed. Okay, what the actors who were on house and stayed busy. Let's be up there mm -hmm. on that track, you ready? I'm ready. You ready? When you train a Mandalorian different than you would just a regular smoke? Well, I don't know. I mean, they're so used to, when she was trained by uh, Ezra's master, like, he wanted her to break, away from the man yeah, line. break the habits of relying on all her different, different weapons. So, I don't know, it's like, yeah, find a balance. It well, appears she has a thing for Ezra. Yep. More than brother, sister. Mm -hmm. So, is this gonna be what takes them to the other galaxy? Is it a Stargate? Kinda looks that way, doesn't it? Yep. Yeah. so few Jedi left. Sentimental. True. Kiki, he's not a, he's not a true Sith either. No, he's a Merc. Jedi and Merc. All right, so there was episode one and two of Ahsoka. Uh, a lot of exciting stuff going on. Uh, introduced, introducing a lot of new characters and uh, you know reuniting us with uh, a lot of loved old ones. So uh, loved more by you than me because they're pretty new to me. Nah. So uh, what do you guys think so far, and uh, what kind of surprises do they have in store for us this season? Um, still. 
Uh, I have not seen all of the old Rebels, the ones that are uh, still around. Obviously, Ezra is out there somewhere. Could be dead. Could be. Could be dead, but, you know, hopefully that's not the case. And, uh, you know, might be uh, one or two others that uh, we're hoping to see. And uh, do you think we're going to see other characters from the Star Wars universe? Are we going to see Luke somewhere down the road? You know, always a possibility. So it uh, depends on how much work the, uh, you know, people who do the deep fake stuff want to put into it. It also depends on if they think it's failing and got to save it. We're going to put in Mando. Right, you know. Mm. You know, Mando is their uh, ace in the hole, as it was with the uh, Book of Boba Fett. I'll be honest with you. I'd be disappointed if, if they brought Mando in for an episode. Really? Because that means they, they, they're trying to save it. Yeah. And they should know, after a few episodes, whether it's working or not. Well, you know, nostalgia does go a long way. And with them, you know, bringing back, uh, you know, a lot, all of the uh, Star Wars Rebels characters, or a lot of the Star Wars Rebels characters, I think that was... You know, really smart of Favreau and Filoni to do that, so... I'll be surprised if we don't see C-3PO and R2-D2 at some point. Yeah, I mean, R2's been in just about everything at this point, so... Mm -hmm. Alright, so uh, let us know your thoughts. What did you guys think of this episode? And, uh, you know, what are you hoping to see in the uh, 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 upcoming episodes this season? So uh, let us know all about it in the comments. Alright, guys, we'll see you on the next one. Hit the subscribe button, subscribe. the like button, and all that stuff. Turn on notifications. Okay, this isn't The Mandalorian, so I guess I'll end it with, may the force be with you. I'll just end it by saying, see ya! Mm -hmm.